All right, it's April 14th. We finally got a couple of nice days here. We got some sun and some wind. We had a couple of good drying days in a row. So this is the first day we're really out in the fields doing some work and we haven't started the planter yet, but our plan is to start that uh, tomorrow. We're gonna start that tomorrow morning in this field. This was soybeans last year. So we had the co-op come out this morning and uh, they used a big spreader um, and, and they, uh, they floated on urea, which is a commercial fertilizer that we use for nitrogen. We put our phosphorus and our, our potassium and a couple of other uh, micronutrients down last fall. We deep banded that in 30 inch rows. Um, we waited until the spring to put our nitrogen on. So we had them put nitrogen on this morning. And now you can see, I think you can see that uh, there's Jim out there, he's digging. And uh, so he's just tilling the soil down about three, four, five inches deep to turn the soil over get it softened up and to work that urea into the ground. If we leave that urea sit on the top of the soil, what happens is it'll pick up the moisture out of the air, either out of the air or off the soil, and it'll soak that moisture up and the nitrogen will start to uh, go into the air, basically. We, we lose it, uh, which is no good for us. It's no good for, for anything. So we want that nitrogen in the dirt. So that's why we dig it into the soils, uh, what's called I guess we call it incorporating the nitrogen into the soil. So we're going to dig it today. The top of the dirt will dry off just a little bit and it'll make a nice seed bed for tomorrow. We'll be able to go over it. Hopefully this is our plan. Go over it with the planter and um, it'll go it'll go nicer rather than having if we've got freshly dug soil sometimes it's got a lot of moisture in it. It gets a little bit wet and it'll stick to the wheels on the planter. So we're going to give this overnight to dry the top off and the planter will float over it nicely. Um, and I did this in the truck because it's so windy out I don't know if you guys will be able to hear me but we'll go out and I'll show you the urea that's spread on top here this isn't dug yet so Jim's over here digging he's gonna turn around and head the other way and we've got everything to the north of him is done being dug and I'll show you right here this is where where it got dug last year so this hasn't been dug yet for the spring but this, if you see the little white pellets, well you can't see it in my hand there, but if you see the little white pellets on the ground, this is what we spread this morning. Uh, this is urea. It's uh, got a high rate of nitrogen in it, and these are the pellets that will uh, start to pick up the moisture and we'll lose our nitrogen. So that's what we're working into the ground. That way it ends up in the dirt and the corn can use it to grow throughout the season. So. That's what we're doing today. We haven't started the planter yet. That'll be in a new video, uh, maybe tomorrow. We'll get that thing up and going, but now it's gonna get fun. We're getting busy in the fields, and uh, and this is when it's gonna get interesting. We're gonna have a lot of videos out for you guys to show you what we're doing every day. So, subscribe to the channel and keep watching because we're gonna have a new video out probably just about every day for the next few weeks.